Bonjour et bienvenue à Coffee Break French. Welcome back to Coffee Break French. In lesson two, we're going to be learning some greetings for different times of the day. You'll also be learning how to say my name is and say it's nice to meet someone. I hope you enjoy the lesson. We're going to begin with a word that we've already heard a few times on Coffee Break French. And that word is a word that's known all across the world. But we're going to try and make sure we're pronouncing it absolutely 100% correctly. That word is bonjour. Bonjour. OK, très bien. Now, there are two different sounds in there. And remember last week when we were listening to our nasal sounds, the first syllable is very nasal. It's bon. Bon. And bon means good. Remember, when I say the word, you repeat after me, and then Anna will repeat after you. Bon. Bon. Bon then means good. And the jour part means day. So bonjour literally means good day. Bon jour. Bon jour. Not bad at all, Anna. What we need to try and make sure is that that second syllable sounds very much like jour, jour. Watch the vowel sound that you make there. Jour. Jour. That's it. In Scotland, we have a tendency to make our oo sounds a little bit more like oo. And the oo sound is used in French, but in the word bonjour, it's very much a different sound. If you're having difficulty saying it, you might want to try thinking of saying jour, as in rhyming with more, and then rounding your lips. Jour. Okay, so hopefully that helped you get the correct sound for bonjour. Now, there's also this strange R at the end. For English native speakers, the R at the end of bonjour is quite tricky to pronounce, and we'll be spending more time on that in a later lesson. Try to get something similar to it for the time being. Bonjour. Bonjour. So, bonjour is used for good morning, literally good day, and it's also used in quite a, a general hello sense. To say good evening to someone, you would say bonsoir. Bonsoir. Très bien. Soir means evening. Soir. Soir. Okay, it's so a, a guttural R at the end. Soir. Soir. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. So we have bonjour. Bonjour. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Okay, bonjour and bonsoir both have the same beginning. It's the word bon, B-O-N, and it's that nasal sound. Bonjour, bonsoir. However, when we come to say good night, we use a slightly different version of the word for good, and that is bonne. Bonne. And that's spelled B-O-N-N-E, as opposed to bon which is spelt B-O-N. Listen to the difference between these two words. Bon, bonne. Bon, bonne. So, for good night, we have bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Très bien. Now, depending on which part of the French-speaking world you're in, you may find slight differences in the pronunciation of that phrase. Sometimes it might be bonne nuit, almost with a kind of skipping N in the middle, or other times it may be bonne nuit, with almost a mini-syllable in the middle there, bonne nuit. And that just really depends where you are. Either way, it's correct. Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Okay, so we have bonjour. Bonjour. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. And bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. 
So, bonjour means good morning, good day, and it's used into the afternoon. Bonsoir is good evening, and bonne nuit, good night. Splitting those words up again, the word jour means day, soir means evening, and nuit means night. Now, there are a couple of other phrases that I'd like to teach you here while we're talking about bonjour and bonsoir and so on. And these are the phrases that you use when you're wishing someone have a nice day or have a nice evening. When you greet someone at first, you would say bonjour in the morning or afternoon. And then when you're leaving them, you would wish them have a nice day. And that phrase is bonne journée. Bon journée. Now watch it because it's it's bonne, not bon. It's bonjour, but bonne journée. Bonne journée. Très bien. The, there is a reason for this, and the reason for it is linked to whether the words are masculine or feminine, but we'll come back to that another time. We don't want to get bogged down with grammar at the moment. So, bonne journée means have a nice day. Let's repeat that again. Bonne journée. Bonne journée. And you can do something very similar to bonsoir, and that becomes bonne soirée. Bonne soirée. And soirée refers to the length of the evening, the, the remainder of the evening. If you wish someone bonne soirée, that means have a nice evening, enjoy the rest of your evening. And indeed, the word soirée is used to mean a party, an evening party. And that's sometimes even a word that we, we use in English. We're having a soirée this evening. So everything that we've learned so far refers to a particular time of the day. But there is a word that we can use as a straightforward hello or a hi. And that is salut. Salut. That's it. And this time we can use that U sound. It's not salut, it's salut. Salut. Listen carefully to the difference between bonjour and salut. Jour, lu. It's a completely different vowel sound. Bonjour, salut. Repeat salut. 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 This comes from the same root as our English word salutation, and it means greetings. Salut. Salut. Now, salut is one of these useful words that can be used in different situations. For example, salut means both hello and goodbye. So you can say salut when you're saying goodbye to someone too. Salut. Salut. But there is another phrase for goodbye. And that is au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Now, au revoir literally means until we see each other again. Until the next seeing. Revoir means to see again. Au revoir. Au revoir. Goodbye. Au revoir. Au revoir. Okay. Now, there are other ways that you can wish someone farewell. You could say, for example, adieu. 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 To you, and you, and you. <laughs> okay, so Anna, are you, you a Sound of Music fan by any chance? Yep. Good stuff. Okay, let's move on. Adieu actually means to God. So it's God be with you, the same as goodbye. Adieu. Adieu. Now, if you're going to be seeing someone soon... You could use this à and add in the word for soon. And the word for soon is bientôt. À bientôt. À bientôt. À bientôt. It means see you soon. À bientôt. À bientôt. Or if you're going to be seeing someone tomorrow, you could say à demain. À demain. And the word demain means tomorrow. À demain. À demain. 
And it's really important that you try to get that nasal sound at the end of demain. 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 Très bien. It's not à demain and then leave it open. You've got to finish it off with a nasal sound. À demain. À demain. Okay, now, as you're repeating these words, hopefully you're not getting too many strange looks around you in the tube or on the train or wherever you are. Hopefully this is helping you get to grips with the pronunciation of French, because it is pretty difficult. But try your best and it will be appreciated. Before we move on from greetings, let's repeat all the words that we've learned so far this episode. To begin with, good day, bonjour. Bonjour. Good evening. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Good night. Bonne nuit. Bonne nuit. Have a nice day or enjoy your day. Bonne journée. Bonne journée. Have a nice evening. Bonne soirée. Bonne soirée. And then there was the word for hello or hi. That was salut. Salut. And then we had our goodbye words. We had au revoir. Au revoir. We had adieu. Adieu. A bientôt, meaning see you later. A bientôt. And see you tomorrow, à demain. À demain. Voilà, très bien, excellent. Okay, we're going to move on to one final thing before this week's lesson's finished, and that is saying what your name is. To say my name is, or I am called, you use a construction in French that really is the translation of I call myself. So I call myself is je M'appelle. Je m'appelle. Très bien. Je m'appelle Marc. Je m'appelle Anna. And hopefully, you have said Je m'appelle followed by your name. Let's try that one more time. Je m'appelle Marc. Je m'appelle Anna. Okay, très bien. So, the reason we're talking about I call myself is because we're going to come back to that construction at a later date to explain it a bit further. But if you think of I am called as I call myself, then it will help you later on. Remember that when you're learning a language, it's not just about translating word for word from one language to another. It's more about translating concepts and ideas. In English, we say I am called. In French, you say, I call myself. And that's the way it is. If someone introduces themselves and says, Je m'appelle Marc, you can say, Nice to meet you, pleased to meet you. And there's one word in French for that phrase. Another example of the situation where one word in one language can be translated differently in another language. The word for nice to meet you or pleased to meet you is Enchanté. 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 Now, we've already had quite a few of these nasal sounds in bonjour and bonsoir. Enchanté is a slightly different nasal sound, and your mouth needs to be wider for that. Enchanté. Enchanté. And that's where we're going to leave it today for this edition of Coffee Break French. Thanks for joining us and we hope it's been useful. You can join the Coffee Break French community on Facebook at facebook.com slash coffeebreakfrench and we're at Learn French on Twitter. Merci beaucoup et à bientôt. This is a production of the Radiolingua Network. Find out more at radiolingua.com. 
You've been listening to a podcast from Season 1 of Coffee Break French. To get access to the bonus materials, which include lesson notes, bonus audio materials, and video versions of these episodes, then head over to the Coffee Break Academy at coffeebreakacademy.com.